Brawl Stars scammed us? No, not really, but a percentage of the Brawl Stars community are thinking they are. Hey, I had other plans for this upload here today, but this is very important. So as we discussed in our last episode here on the channel, April 1st is around the corner, which is actually here today. And this year, it's in the form of a challenge and a song we're gonna get into, but I want this to be at the very beginning of the video. There is a new eight win challenge offering a good amount of rewards when it comes to progression, which is quite different than what we're normally used to. Taking a look at the top left-hand corner of the screen, Unlimited Lives. Unlimited Lives with an exception where the April Fool's part, I believe, kicks in a little bit. The biggest point of contention I've seen in the community since this challenge's release is this message that's popping up here. Can't start the game, no more attempts left. What the heck are you talking about, dude? I have unlimited attempts. Where the funny meme or the joke is coming into play that people are actually thinking it's like a bug and a little bit frustrated with Supercell over is you can't do this challenge with a team. You have to do this with randoms. As in any April Fool's joke, it loses the fun if you gotta explain it, you know what I mean? But the only other thing that I want to discuss before we get a little bit deeper in this video, seeing that this challenge lasts six days and 19 hours, it might be within your best interest to wait to do this. It's unlimited life, so you are guaranteed all these rewards on the challenge. So grand total of 350 credits, 500 tokens, some PowerPoint and 1,500 coins. If you don't have enough credit saved up for Willow when she drops in one day in 19 hours, it might be useful to save those credits. Of course, once she is released. So in our last episode here on the channel, we had discussed that last year's April Fool's Day offered a challenge where the end prize was five free gems. Now, we didn't get free gems from what I can see here, but to some, arguably, what we ended up getting here this morning for April Fool's could be a little bit cooler than five free gems, and that is a brand new song with a branding that is taking the form of the April Fool's joke. One of the coolest skins being released in this update has just dropped today. Day along with the challenge and that is pop star Janet such an amazing skin the skin design is phenomenal but the animations are my favorite thing where the joke comes into play is the branding for the music coming out from Brawl Stars is the bad randoms it's a play on the meme that's going on in Brawl Stars where all randoms that we come across are bad well we arrived at the only day during the year where this meme can be flipped on its head instead of bad randoms it's good randoms and I Ironically, I'm guessing it's the sole reason why we can't hop into the challenge with teammates. Stated here at the end of the announcement, you will find your good random today. Quite honestly, they're making us try to find a good random today. <laughs> it's always hard to try to predict what's going to be coming around the corner any April 1st because it's so dang random. But to be honest, I'm quite content with what ended up happening here today. Not only did we get a really, really cool skin introduced, but we also, in this music video, got introduced to a new version to Buzz, Stu, and Poco. Basically the inverse of their pop star character where they're all edgy and rock and roll looking while well, they're here looking super, super good. What would you use to describe that? Like uh, clean cut? I don't know. <laughs> There's a lot of people really, really excited about the song itself as well as these skins. Taking a look at the actual music video itself, it is easy to see why people are so excited about these characters in the music video. One thing in particular I've been seeing a lot of people discussing is wouldn't it be cool if these were actually introduced to the game or is it even a possibility? I'm not sure seeing that it's kind of an April Fool's thing. I'm guessing this was made for a one-off situation. I doubt that these renditions of the skins are meant to be like a long-term thing here inside the Brawl Stars community. But hey, I'm not going to say there isn't a potential for them to come. Seeing that the non-joking version of these characters, the bad version, Randoms are actually in the game, the skins. We got Trash Poco, Wicked Stew, and Born Bad Buzz. So it's definitely fun to toy around with the possibility, as we've also discussed in past Brawl News episodes, when it comes to the themes of skins in the game, they always have skins that accompany that theme in a small cluster, almost like a brawler family, but with skins. That notion being so true to the point where if a skin is left alone for too long, that isn't accompanied by a theme that we've had 
had from an update. It's a very feasible outcome or safe to theorize that a update would come around the corner sometime in the future, introducing the theme that this skin would make sense to go into and drop other skins to fit into that cluster, much like here for Magma Mandy and the fun theories that surrounds this theme. So seeing that we have pop star Janet here, it might make some sense to make another cluster and add those three really cool skins. It's definitely a potential. I'm not feeling amazing about it or anything like that, seeing that it is April Fool's, but hey, maybe we'll just have to wait and see. Now, there are some other really interesting things people are piecing out from the music video itself that might be a bit lore related, but before we get into that, I would like to pick up pop star Janet here. Dude, just look how freaking flashy and beautiful this skin is. And along with this, we also get the profile icon. It's looking phenomenal, dude. Let's go. Also a pin. I keep forgetting about those sick animations and then the profile icon. As you can see here, Popstar Janet doesn't have a specific skin set dedicated to her in the top left-hand corner, so she's not in the bad random skin cluster, whatever you wanna call it. So I guess that could be giving a little bit more hope to the theory of those three skins coming to the game sometime in the future. We'll have to wait and see, but as you guys can see, the animations are just insane and the super's even cooler dude look at this oh my gosh dude she drops like disco balls with such cool effects oh it's so sick now, it is a little bit early on. This music video just came out a few hours ago at the point that I'm recording this video, but there has been a few really interesting details pulled away from it already. Taking a look at a tweet from Hunt here, saying, in this video appeared for the second time ever, this plane called dreamjet.jpg. It's been on the starpark.biz website for two plus years now. And also, I remember a plane sound in WKBRL 3.0. Over here on the website, it can be seen right here. Super, super cool. Again, this very well could just be a fun exception, seeing that the context of the music video is they are superstars, so they're flying around in jets. But it could give a reason as to why this plane is over here on the website itself, seeing that we really don't have an explanation for this when it came to past theory crafting. And thanks to the webmaster who made the website itself speculated to be Colette, she collected all of these photos for a particular reason to investigate star park and give us the outside world additional information on what is going on at star park so it could be a tie to it i mean the background is kind of matching up with it with the skyline back there which we also have a few things to discuss about that it's kind of the same there in that photo maybe they derived some inspiration from this photo itself or at the end of the day it could just be a fun little exception but nonetheless seeing that we are in the month of april this is like like the Star Park lore month. Whenever Star Park related developments happen, most of the time it happened in the month of April, seeing that the anniversary of the WKBRL live stream is April 19th. And on top of that, it is hard not to notice all of the really interesting lore pieces that the dev team has been implementing in each of the updates releasing. So, hey, a cool little tasty tidbit that I thought you guys would enjoy there. Maybe we'll be seeing more of this in the future. But moving away from that, individuals have noticed a few other really cool details from the music video itself, and I'm sure there's going to be several more found, seeing once again that this is pretty early on. It was just released a few hours ago, but we have the season two environment, Super City in the background with some characters that should be familiar. We have the dinosaur robot, as well as I think that's the boss robot on the left, or maybe Kong Surge. Someone thinks it's King Kong. I'm not sure what it is, but a cool detail nonetheless, keeping it within the Brawl Stars universe. But on top of that, as time goes on, I'm sure other really interesting details will be uncovered within this music video. We've got this one here of another like skin of Buzz. It's so cool, man. But yeah, once again, I had other plans for this video here today, but I found it to be incredibly pressing seeing that I did see quite a few comments of people expressing their frustration over the challenge, not being able to cue into it with a teammate thinking that it's just a bug or something like that. I'm almost certain that it's by design because 
was of April Fools. And on top of that, I really, really wanted to get that out there before, well, I'm sure a lot of you guys have already done the challenge. I can only make a video so fast. But if you're still saving up for Willow, it would make sense to wait for this, seeing that it's lasting six days and 19 hours here for the resources that you can utilize on her. But either way, best of luck. Happy April Fool's Day to all of you guys. Losing a crap ton might get a little bit frustrating, but it's nice to know that we get unlimited lives and we are guaranteed all the rewards here. But there you have it, everyone. I hope you all enjoyed this video here today or found it useful in any way. Always trying to do my best to keep you guys in the loop and informed with things in the community. But yeah, if you did enjoy it, make sure to slap a like on it. I really appreciate that. Have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day. Keep having fun, Brawl Stars, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Adios and take care. Whew.